I guess they found out about my secret back door. killer's talisman. I'm sure that this was just the sort of thing Madame Cassandra was talking about. Jim. Hello, Cassie.
Could you put me in a trance? Of course. Let's begin. Now relax. Concentrate on the locket. Block everything else out. Concentrate. 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 I've got to rush off. I'll explain later. What about us? I'm sorry. I, I don't have the time. Thanks. I'm telling you. I saw his secret lab. I saw the way in. Are you crazy? You know I can't get a warrant out of your trip to a crystal gazer. There's no time for a warrant. I thought you'd want to know when I'd come across the killer. I guess I was wrong. But something weird happened down there. And I'm going to find out what it was. With or without you. Wait! Get it! I want in on this cockamamie scheme of yours! You gotta smoke. I didn't know you smoked, Kitty. I do now. Come on, kid. I thought you knew what you were doing. Are you ready, Detective? Our killer's hideout's right down those steps. I called some of my men. They should be here to back us up soon. But just in case. It's like we're a little late to help victim number nine. God. Th that can't be. It's him. You know the stiff? That's the killer. I'm sure of it. Uh, you were wrong, Jim. That poor sap couldn't be the killer. But at least we found his hideout, even if he isn't here. You did good work. We'll get some clues we can use on it. And they're all going to point to that man right there on the altar, detective. That's the killer. I'm sure of it. What, kid? The Dahlia. 
it's missing. Elliot, better have taken anything. Elliot, I want these amateurs removed immediately. They've botched everything. Why, if we hadn't been tipped off that they were down here. Amateurs, we just bust this case wide open. We weren't too chicken to I had enough sense to get a search warrant. You're just Now we won't sore. be able to use one shred of evidence. Sore because we found the killer's hideout first. You're worried our mugs will be on the front page instead of yours. There'll be no contact with the press about this. Mr. Ness? You just busted illegally into a club owned by some very important people. People with contacts to Washington. All the way to the top. They're going to be very unhappy with what we found here. You can't just cover this Mr. up. Mr. Pearson, you're way out of your jurisdiction here. You're in no position to be arguing with anyone. But how can you... I'm going to do what's in the best interest of this country. President Roosevelt was just on the radio. The Japs have bombed Pearl Harbor. We're going to war. My involvement with the Torso murders ended with little fanfare in December of 1941. Officially, the case remained open and unsolved, but no new bodies were ever found, and no new suspects ever turned up. The mess at the Raven Room was hushed up, but there were those of us who knew that a ninth victim was found in a secret lab underneath the streets of Cleveland. They later identified him as Dr. Eisenstadt, an expatriated Austrian aristocrat who had fled Europe during the rise of Hitler's Nazi party. Whether this man was merely the last of a series of victims, as the police believed, or the torso killer himself, as I had always suspected, no one was able to say. His murderer remained unknown and at large.